Hi and welcome back. Uh, today I wanted to show off uh, the differences between two uncommon metallic finishes that Electra offered. And there's a little bit of a confusion as to which is what and uh, I might have even aided to that. So I want to show that off. Uh, also, this is an 83 and my graphite's an 84, so I want to show off some production differences that you can spot if you're looking for one of these guitars. You can tell what year they are. Not that there's a huge difference in quality or anything, but uh, just for uh, you know your own curiosity. And then real quick, I want to run through the different pickup sounds available on these Tritone. This is an X185. Lots of the Electras had these. Uh, humbucker single coil humbucker setups uh, very similar so uh, and they're real versatile even though there's only four controls there's a lot of options available and I'm going to try to demystify that basically the, the easy thing to remember is if all the switches are down it operates like a, a dual humbucking pick guitar like a Gibson or something so the front is uh, your neck pick neck humbucker centers both Each of these has a push pull. Uh, the first is coil cut for the humbuckers, the second turns on the center, and the third puts the bridge pickup out of phase with the other two pickups. So, you know, you double your tones just by going to single coil. center it gets a lot of uh, canceling boinkiness basically all three single coils on now the phase which um, will make it sound real thin there's a lot of frequency cancellation going on <laughs> whoa that's not supposed to come off so you can use it as humbucker non-humbucker Remember, it's only this, so you're not going to hear any difference when it's in the neck position. And there you have it. So lots of different tones available. Um, don't be afraid to experiment. Most people, you know, find four or five tones they can get to real quick. And uh, don't be overwhelmed by it, you know, just because there's 18 available options. You know, don't feel you got to use them all. So I'm going to show this color to you real quick. Again, this is silver tone. This is an X185 in silver tone, uh, which to me is kind of a gold, uh, maybe a little green hint to it, but I don't know if that's just a clear yellowing over the years. This is a 30-year-old guitar or what, but uh, there it is. The 83s have got a round pickup ring around the uh, single coils. The 84s would have a more squared off one. 83s have got these like speed knobs with the notches on the top um, for push pulls. Um, the 84s have a different knob. And 83 is the first year they start using the bird logo. So you're going to see the bird on there and the word Phoenix. By 84, and I'll show you that right now, <clears throat> start using the West Tone name on the headstock. So you'll see uh, Electra the Bird and then West Tone at the end there. And this is a graphite. This is a more brownish tone. I almost call it kind of an olive green. Again, I don't know if that's a clear coat or what. But uh, much different than the, the Silver Stone. So graphite was uh, kind of darkish. And the Silver Stone is much more gold colored. And then here are those knobs that are fatter on top than they are on the bottom make it really easy to push pull so there you have it 83 84 um phoenixes 
Um, don't be afraid to experiment, play out, and uh, enjoy. Thanks.